What's up, guys? Back at it again. Wrestling Reptiles. Got Chase with me today. He brought some cool animals over we're going to show you guys. I had some new pickups recently. We actually had quite a few. Yeah. Got some more coming as well, actually. We're going to talk about that a little bit today. So... I acquired a phantom female. She's pretty cool. She's in shed. Gotten her to take one meal for her so far. She actually, believe it or not, is the same age as those ultra ivories I purchased. She's about 18 months old. Going on two years old. She's a solid like 9 to 10 foot animal. I mean, and so the cool part is, is now that we've acquired a female. Now that we've acquired a female phantom. We can take this animal now and breed it to Nerd, our Golden Child Phantom Platinum, and we will be able to produce some Super Phantoms. Super Phantoms are your blue-eyed leucistic retics. I'm not 100% sure they have blue eyes. Mine should because of the Golden Child gene, if it works out how I want it to. Some more research I'll have to be do. But Brian Barchuk at BHB has a uh, Super Phantom. His name's Casper. He's one of the first reticulated pythons I held when I was getting really interested in breeding the morphs. So, big project here. And then we also got the anaconda project going a little bit farther. We're not sure, you know, we got Bellacondas coming. It's I'm assuming now, now that I got her to eat this guinea pig. Yeah. Now that I got the guinea pig going, I'm assuming she did take her breed. But look at this guy, this girl. This girl, is she's got some good size on her. I got her to eat a guinea pig. I'm going to try to start getting her to eat like two or three. <coughs> She'll be 14 foot soon. This this girl should be 16 foot. I'm thinking 15 foot by the time that she's three years old. We're trying to breed her next year. And we're probably trying to breed her at three and a half years old. See so you guys this is a seven foot long cage. So I, I give her a solid nine, nine foot. Solid. And, she, and she's pretty sweet. The original guy that actually owned her was uh, Ian down at Reptilian Exotics. Ian's a great guy. He's actually breeding Asian water monitors. Go check him out, guys, if you want to get some cool monitors or some cool captive bred animals. He does a great job at raising these animals and getting them going. She's got some really nice iridescence. And when she sheds, she's only going way prettier. It took a long time to find a female phantom like this, guys. I mean, it's kind of hard to find with some good size on them there. One of those animals everybody wants to keep. Don't forget, guys, this little guy's for sale. I got him in the deal with her. We've been work I've been working with him. Got him eating good. Make a great first retake for someone. Nice normal, pretty colors, high iridescence, high silvers. Some nice clean markings. Bright it's almost like a color. bluish silver. Too. Yeah, dude, yeah. he's really got some nice colors on him now that he shed. I was really kind of impressed. But uh, I think he'd be somebody's great first retake. You know, he's got that point where he's about to start taking off and become one of these girls. This size. He was a cool pickup. He, he's definitely getting friendlier now. Some good eating, some working with him. We got a video on the Facebook of him being a little nippy, me and Chase playing with him. Uh, but honestly, guys, he'll be a cool pet. If somebody wants to pick him up, you know, I've marked him down to like a buck fifty. Was asking 200. I just want him to have a good home, good pet home. 